Integrating Govi devices with Home Assistant opens up a world of possibilities for smart home enthusiasts. This combination allows you to automate and control your lighting, sensors, and other devices from a single, unified platform. With seamless integration, you gain the ability to customize routines, set schedules, and create personalized automations tailored to your lifestyle. Enhanced customization means you can fine-tune how your devices interact, improving both convenience and energy efficiency. Whether you're looking to streamline daily tasks or experiment with advanced smart home features, connecting Govi devices to Home Assistant offers a flexible and powerful solution for modern living. As of October 2025, there are several effective ways to integrate Govi devices with Home Assistant, each catering to different needs and preferences. Local control through device-specific APIs allows for direct communication over your home network, offering low latency and offline operation. Bluetooth low energy integration is another option, ideal for devices within close range, providing fast and straightforward connectivity. For those who require remote access, cloud-based control using the Govi API enables management of devices from anywhere, though it relies on internet connectivity and may introduce some delay. Additionally, third-party solutions like Govi 2MQTT and Govi LAN HASS offer community-driven integrations, often emphasizing robust local control and customization. By understanding these methods, users can select the approach that best fits their smart home setup. Local control via the device API allows your Govi devices to communicate directly with Home Assistant over your home network. This method eliminates the need for cloud servers, resulting in significantly lower latency and faster response times. Because all data stays within your local network, your smart home operations remain private and can function even if your internet connection goes down. To take advantage of local control, ensure both your Govi devices and Home Assistant server are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Assigning static IP addresses to each device helps maintain stable connections. Enabling LAN control in the Govi app is also essential for this setup. Overall, Local Control offers a reliable and secure way to manage your smart devices. To set up Local Control for your Govi devices with Home Assistant, begin by ensuring that both your devices and the Home Assistant server are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. This shared network is essential for direct communication and low latency operation. Next, reserve a static IP address for each Govi device within your router settings. Assigning static IPs helps maintain consistent connectivity and simplifies device management. After configuring the network, open the Govi app and enable LAN control for each device you wish to integrate. This step allows Home Assistant to communicate directly with your Govi devices over the local network, enhancing responsiveness and privacy. Once these steps are complete, your devices are ready for seamless local automation within your smart home ecosystem. Bluetooth Low Energy, or BLE, offers a straightforward way to integrate Govi devices with Home Assistant, especially when the devices are located nearby. This method is valued for its simplicity, requiring minimal setup and configuration. Communication between the Home Assistant server and Govi devices is fast and efficient, resulting in quick response times for commands and status updates. However, BLE integration does require that the Home Assistant host is within close range of the devices to maintain a stable connection. As long as your server has Bluetooth capabilities and the devices are positioned appropriately, BLE provides a reliable and low latency solution for smart home automation. This approach is ideal for users seeking immediate control without relying on cloud services or complex network configurations. To implement Bluetooth Low Energy, or BLE, integration with your Govi devices 
Start by confirming that your Home Assistant server is equipped with Bluetooth capabilities. This may involve using a built-in Bluetooth adapter or connecting a compatible USB dongle. Next, ensure that your Govi devices are placed within close range of the server, as BLE communication is most reliable over short distances. Maintaining this proximity helps prevent connection drops and ensures prompt device responses. Once these prerequisites are met, you can proceed to configure the BLE integration within Home Assistant, allowing for fast and efficient local control of your smart devices. Cloud control using the Govi API allows users to manage their devices remotely, providing flexibility and convenience no matter where they are. By connecting through your Govi account and using an API token, you can access and adjust your smart home devices from outside your local network. This method is particularly useful for those who need to monitor or control their home environment while away. However, it's important to note that cloud integration relies on a stable internet connection, which can introduce higher latency compared to local control methods. If your internet service experiences interruptions, device responsiveness may be affected. Carefully consider these factors when choosing cloud control to ensure it aligns with your automation needs and expectations. To set up cloud integration between your Govi devices and Home Assistant, begin by obtaining an API key from the Govi app. This key allows Home Assistant to securely communicate with your Govi account over the internet. After logging into the Govi app, navigate to the account settings and request your unique API key. Once you have the key, Open Home Assistant and access the Integrations menu. Add the Govi integration and enter your API key when prompted. This enables cloud-based control, allowing you to manage your Govi devices remotely. Keep in mind that this method relies on a stable internet connection and may introduce some latency compared to local control options. Third-party integrations like govi 2 mqtt and govilun Has have emerged from the Home Assistant community to enhance the control of Govi devices. These projects focus on robust LAN-first communication, allowing devices to respond quickly and reliably without relying on cloud services. Govi E2MQTT bridges Govi devices with Home Assistant using the MQTT protocol, which is known for its efficiency and flexibility in smart home environments. Meanwhile, Gove Lanhas leverages the local area network API to provide direct control over Gove lights, emphasizing low latency and improved responsiveness. Both integrations often offer additional features, such as advanced automation options and expanded device compatibility. Manual installation and configuration may be required but these solutions empower users to customize their smart home setup with greater privacy and reliability. Manually installing third-party integrations for Govi devices in Home Assistant typically involves downloading the integration files from community repositories and placing them in the appropriate custom components directory. After installation, you may need to restart Home Assistant to recognize the new integration Configuration often requires editing YAML files to specify device details, such as IP addresses or API tokens. It's important to carefully follow the documentation provided by the integration developer, as setup steps can vary. If you encounter issues, double check that your devices are on the same network and have the latest firmware updates. Reviewing Home Assistant logs can help identify configuration errors or connectivity problems. For persistent issues, consulting community forums or the integration's GitHub page may provide additional troubleshooting guidance. Before integrating Govi devices with Home Assistant, there are several important factors to address to ensure a smooth and secure experience. First, make sure all your Govi devices have the latest firmware updates as these can improve stability and unlock new features. Next, verify your network configuration 
by confirming that your devices and Home Assistant server are connected to the same Wi-Fi network and subnet. This helps maintain reliable communication between devices. It's also essential to implement robust security measures, such as using strong passwords and enabling encryption to safeguard your smart home ecosystem against potential threats. Taking these steps will lay a strong foundation for seamless automation and enhanced control over your smart devices. Selecting the right integration method for your Govi devices and Home Assistant setup is crucial for creating a smart home environment that is both cohesive and efficient. Each approach, whether local control, Bluetooth, cloud-based, or third-party integration, offers distinct advantages and considerations. By evaluating your network capabilities, device locations, and privacy preferences, you can determine which method aligns best with your needs. Ensuring compatibility and proper configuration not only enhances responsiveness, but also strengthens security within your home ecosystem. Ultimately, a well-chosen integration strategy allows you to fully leverage the automation and customization potential of your smart devices, resulting in a seamless and reliable smart home experience.